this is Emily's cold, or no, excuse me, this is the cold read on the suspect in Emily Noble's case. Um, I'm going to refrain from any anger that I feel tonight. I'm going to refrain from saying what I really want to say. I'm going to stick with what came through in the cold read for the suspect. But I also will give a fair warning. I know you've viewed my page through a man's, another man's account. I've called you out on my face, on my YouTube page. But I also know many other things that I'm not going to place in this video because I will not give up details that could risk the investigation for Emily. You will not get me to that point of anger. So no. This man is manipulating, manipulating women to make, make them feel bad for him. He would be using women to, um, it's, it's a feeling of he's using women to make it like he's battered or he's, or, or he's the sick person and you know, it, it's very twisted because he's using Emily's demise to his advantage still. He is making women feel like, oh, she ran off. No, she didn't. And you know she didn't. You know she did not. And to claim and still drag her name in the mud saying she left is a crock of shit. And you know it. Excuse my anger. Excuse my language. I usually don't get this angry in my videos. He's like a person that's preying on people to get him, them to draw into him instead of the other way around. This investigation be, should be focused on Emily solely, but instead he's making it about him and he's sucking people in and drawing people in to his supposed demise instead of Emily being found. That was the first thing, and it's it, and I know there's more than one woman he's speaking to because I've gotten multiple two two two, and the letter with K in the in the, in his cold in Emily's cold read it was a woman named Kate or a woman with a K. Um, <clears throat> so that was my first, you know, wow, like he's truly literally just still going on in, in some sick, deluded way. Um, I'm going to read off the things that that came through for the cold read for him. Um, sorry, I heard a word and I didn't make it out. So, the first word that I got automatically, boom, was lake. First word that came through for this guy. Precision. Founder, or could be found. Dark, sick, denies. Fight. Severe, or sever. Severe or severed. Crime scene. Crimson. Believable. Ponder. Waste. Fake. Delusional. The word delete, which means he's either deleting something, say off of maybe social media or off his phones, 
I would like to know why records have not been the or warrants have not been served for phone records for such and such and such. Who knows? I don't know. It possibly could have been. And it's crazy because in my first video that I just did that you guys are probably going to read for watch first, Emily spoke of a piece of paper and I couldn't figure out what she was talking about. But then I realized seeing this, I see him writing something on a piece of paper. The word trigger. Now trigger can mean a trigger to a gun or a trigger as in some people have triggers as in behavioral triggers and you can just lose you can just literally lose your your um you can go from zero to 100 just from a trigger and i think that's what that's referring to remains buried abby lane case when i asked her before how she was killed i kept seeing this picture of him bearing down like it's something like on top of her like this it was either he strangled her really badly or he drowned her as such and by holding her underwater and she fought him and she fought him as in she tried to push him away dead time street sign in the other vision I seen this man driving his car what looked to be a car and he was driving and I see this grass and these just 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 a grass driving by like it would have been a side of a highway the word this word with an N I'm not gonna give it out I'm gonna give it to Lindsay it's an actual place so um, the word ponder again now this could mean pond her or pond, ponder. Wasteful, liar, dark again. These, these words came up on two different sheets in the same reading. So also the word shoes again. See, I didn't even remember that part when I did the cold read, but when I did the shoes, it was, it was definitely how funny because M mentioned it. The word Thompson, flirting, making himself the victim. I was shown as if he was doing these fake tears and he's, he's talking to these women to gain sympathy and using Emily's demise to do so even though he does not care. He didn't care about Emily. Maybe in his own little sick way he did, but... The word chain, case, case kept being said, case kept being said, cold or gold. She said, also said chain. I'm going to leave this one word out um, just because I think that's an imperative part of what, what she said in the last video I just did because that's actually the word that came up. Um, and store, which oddly... Wow, I didn't even realize when I do cold reads, I'll just automatically start writing what I hear. And it's funny because it was repeated on this paper. Ponder again, lake, decision, falter, mad at me, mad at me, blamed me, drop, point, sink. She showed me this, this, um, this, this, like, uh, when people do this with their hands, like, like, it was almost like, she's gone. Endeavor. Um, the word yes, but I can't remember what the question was. She said blame, mind control he used Emily in a way to control her actions to control who she spoke to um, I think it was to the point where 
it got so controlling that she that's why she wanted to leave she wanted to be out of that relationship because he became this completely different person and she knew it was time to go um that was the one thing that really struck me because at the end of this um i got the word sake take water clandestine um they all know uh, the word brother, cousin, shows a me a man in handcuffs. And then the word saint, um, another word, friend, shelter. I asked her, this is the point where I asked her if I could give a message to somebody she knew. She said the word Timothy, Joey, um, friend, shelter, tell them public I want I wasn't she wanted me to she this is where she chimed into his cold read she said I want the public to know I didn't go anywhere he took me he took me he took me and then she said find me um, so there's two words out of all of this that I cannot say because I feel like she actually repeated that in my last video that I'm going to post up and I feel like that's very significant to her case. Um, which is very odd that I can even, I, I didn't even think because she literally was chiming through and I, then I realized she said it again and again here with me and it's just really sad that Emily had to go through that. She was a very giving and loving person and the suspect just had to steal her life, had to take her joy away. And one more, one more way of controlling her. But I will say this, the police are going to find her. The police are not going to give up on her. People are not going to give up on her. So it is best if whoever did this turned themselves in. I am repeating what in spirit form says. Um, and I think if you want and if you really cared or if you have a heart within you that you are going to make this right and you are going to literally fix this what you've done and you're going to literally make it right and you're going to help Emily seek justice by giving your part of telling what happened because Emily's not going to stop I'm not going to stop looking for Emily. Neither are the police or the search parties. And it's really sad because you are going to have to face her. You are going to have to face her. And when a spirit is, is taken, their life is taken, the person that took their life, you will have to face that person and the next realm you will have to ask for forgiveness and I doubt there's going to be forgiveness if you cannot make it right in any way shape or form this video I want people to know that in cases that I work I work with spirit forms and what they tell me and I feel like, I feel seriously saddened by this case. In any case that people just up and disappear and terribly, you know, 
what's wonderful is she spoke of her mom and dad and she spoke of her sister being out there somewhere alive and it's wonderful it's wonderful because she's not alone so I want you to understand you did not destroy her you just you just took her sense of body away you took her presence here on the earth as in her body you did not take her energy because energy never dies you are going to have to face that one day so I really hope you do the right thing and turn yourself in because it's nothing ever stays hidden that is why people like me are out here helping and like I said I have no motive I don't care I do not take money in any way shape or form I don't work with people that take rewards so I will not stop looking for Emily neither will the police so you have a choice to make because I will not stop until Emily's found have a good night people